Welcome back Square Steaders. I'm Mike with Square One Farms and I am hiding behind this chicken coop here because it is so windy I'm afraid that's all you're going to be able to hear if I don't. Anyway, this video is a response to a challenge. Uh, Bill over at Honest Open Permaculture has challenged us. Uh, he wants to know what livestock we have had do have and plan on having and that's what this video is all about first of all let me tell you a little bit about Bill um, he's he's an up-and-coming channel and uh, he's doing some really cool stuff over there right now he's he's doing a uh, uh, ancient Aztec gardening experiment uh, I'm really excited to see how that works out for him uh, anyway go check him out tell him that uh, uh, square one sent you and uh, hope you enjoy his channel. Moving on with his challenge. Uh, let's talk a little bit about the animals that we do have. I'm going to talk about them first because a couple months ago we did a uh, Meet the Animals video. Um, so I'm not going to go into great detail, uh, but I will give you a little rundown about what's going on with the, the current livestock situation for us. And uh, then I'm going to hand it over to the girls to uh, handle what we have had and what we plan to have. We have goats. This guy is following me. Uh, this is Joker. He's a Sonnen. He's our buck. He's running with our two other uh, Sonnen does. Uh, we also have this guy, Super Super Calm. He's a mix between Nubian and La Mancha. Um, he'll stick with, with our buck here. And then we have another female. And she is the brother of Willie. The weather. Yes, I know. Call, called your name. Uh, she should be pregnant as well. We are hoping to have a bunch of new babies in the spring. <laughs> so in this in this breeding pen, you see our um, some of our light brahmas, and over in this next breeding pen, you see the same thing: more light brahmas. Over in this breeding pen, we've just started with some Jersey Giants. We're actually using a, an old livestock trailer to, to house some of our chickens. What these chickens are, are uh, too old to be in the brooder, but old enough to be outside. Uh, but not old enough to be with the big chickens. So that's what these, these are, uh, the white and black ones. Those are Brahmas, minus this one silver lace Polish. Um, and then are the dark colored ones. We've got two. We've got a black, a splash, uh, and maybe a blue. We'll find out if, it's, if, if it ends up being a blue or not. But uh, those are Andalusians. The Silver Lakes Polish is more of a rescue. We sold all of our, our birds several months ago, and uh, we kept this one because it has a uh, scissor beak. So it's, it's become more of a pet, and but it also she's she's a great nanny to all these younger younger chicks. So that pretty much ties up what we have when it comes to chickens. We have our specialty birds that, that we show, and uh, be looking for a build series. I'm turning a carport into a chicken house. I'm working on that as we speak, and some uh, that build series should be coming out very shortly on how to do that. Look ahead, the sea is calm, and I know we've been through a lot, but just wait. See right over here, if you can hear me over this wind, uh, that is Sonny. He is our retired barrel racing horse. Uh, Keelan, our eldest daughter, uh, used to barrel race him. He got injured. He is retired and since then has started to go blind. So we keep his area very small uh, so that he can start memorizing areas and, and we don't move anything around. So we just do what it is that we do with him which is just feeding a lot of hay. Uh, this is just where he'll spend the rest of his days and we just take care of him and, and do that thing. Uh, other than that, we have, that's it. 
really weird. We're, that's the least amount of animals I think we've ever had since we moved out here. Uh, we have a dog. His, he's a boxer. Uh, his, his name is Perseus. His dad was Zeus. Perseus, son of Zeus. Anyway, uh, that's it. That is it. We've got two bird cats. But uh, I'm going to hand it over to the girls and uh, let them take it from here. Hope you enjoy. We've had a bunch of goats. Tell them, sis. We've had pygmies, Nigerians. Nubians and Lamanches. We've had pigs. We've had American guinea hogs and Herefords. We've had guineas. Super loud. We've had alpacas. We've had Suris and Wakayas. Turkeys and Mo chickens and Colonel Sanders. We've had Rhode Islands, Wyandots, Polish, Cinnamon Queens, Lagerns, Orpingtons. Australorps, I am Samanis, Americanas, Cornish, Bark Rocks, Cucamarans, Brahmas, Silkies, Jersey Giants, and Andalusians. Okay, so what does the future hold for us and our livestock? I'm gonna buy me a sheep. No, 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 please be normal, please, please, please Well, y'all get to have fun, go on, go on, go on, go on, I'm going to get you some no. Fun. No. No. no, 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 I got it, I got it, I got it, fine, okay, I'm not going to have a yapper dog, we're going to get us some sheep, we're going to get some quails, we're gonna get some sultan chickens, cause we need more chickens. Uh, ducks, quack quack. And uh, I think we're probably also in the later future gonna look into getting Dexter cows. So that's what the future holds for us. I apologize for the mess. I wasn't expecting company. Uh, I'm hiding in the shop because it is extremely windy out there and there is no way you're going to be able to hear anything else that I say. So at this point, uh, I think that I'm supposed to challenge another channel to this livestock challenge and apparently the real challenge behind this whole process is getting a hold of other channels. <laughs> it's, uh, it's taking a while for everybody to respond that I've tried to contact. So instead of waiting around and putting everyone on hold, uh, I think we're just gonna move forward and challenge you. We're gonna put a post on Facebook with this video on it. I'll put a link in the description. Why don't y'all go to our Facebook page and uh, post on the link below your livestock. What livestock have you had? What livestock do you want to have? What livestock do you have now? Post your photos, post your videos, interact with us. We'd love to hear from you and, and see what, what y'all uh, have in store for us. Anyway, uh, we're going to, I think I'm gonna close this video out, but before I do, please, if you like this video, give us a big old thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, will you please do so and push the notification bell so you know when we've got new videos coming out. Anyway, uh, this is Mike with Square One Farms and I am signing off for now, but we'll be back real soon.